Okay, since we are able to play Blitzball again, I'll be attempting to get Waka's Overdrive status reels. I want to get it because I want to explore how we can utilize it in the upcoming boss battles. I mean, pretty sure that the majority of you who have played this game, especially for those who have attended for the Platinum Trophy, um, you won't really see any use out of Waka's other overdrives besides attack reels since it's the most lethal one, especially at max stats. That's why I want to see if there will be any potential if we use status reels against certain bosses, like full break or we can just blind, silence, whatever them. Anyway, you will need to meet a certain amount of battles, certain number of battles before status will reappear as a prize in the Blitzball League. But since by default, you always have this one as the first one, like random prizes without the status reels, you will need to play it first unless you are willing to reset data, which will basically reset everyone's levels, techniques, etc, etc. Bar Tidus's jack shot technique. Anyway, I have also confirmed that I will be getting status reels as the next first place prize here in the league by using this method. So remember that. If you want to check first if status reels will appear as the league prize, then set data and then just reload your save file. So here we go. Also for Blitzball League, we will need to play a total of 10 rounds. But if we're we're gonna be efficient, we only need to win 7 and then we can just forfeit the rest of the matches. Okay, I have successfully recruited Waka back in the team, but... Oh wait, he actually has a higher level than that, so... That's good, because I plan on really using Waka. Um, difference between data stats, 61 speed, Waka 6 speed, endurance, Waka's lower... Shoot, okay. Waka is higher shoot versus that, huh? Hmm. Okay, let's go with the usual Waka and then Letty. Oops, wait, wait, wait. That was a mistake. Nope. Lutidus, Waka, Letty, Jasu, Bota, then Kipa. Don't. Okay, what's that technique too? Okay, we're gonna go with this team. No need for marks. What is ours? Do the usual strategy. Uh, what a bad start. Although I think we are able to endure this too. Hopefully. Let's see will be successful. Okay, good. That's a great start. They swim really fast, by the way. Mm. We'll pass from here. Can't really use Waka yet, as there will be two guarding him. Have to bait the one there first. Shoot, endurance only three. Can't reduce really Bota either. Maybe I'll pass it to Waka later. Gotta ensure that I score first. Then we can pass it again to Letty. Always make sure that they aren't gonna try and guard you. Waka's 11 endurance, maybe he will be able to withstand the attack of the one guarding beside him. Won't be able to get very near. This should be it. We can break, then shoot 10. This is a Venom shot since it only costs 20 HP. Okay, good. 16, 13. Okay, so it hit the goalkeeper instead. 
That's fine. I was hoping it won't trigger. Usually the forwards have a hard time blocking the ball. Mm, this could be bad. Pass. Even Letty can block it. He might be able to score now. Yeah, pretty sure they'll be able to score. That's very near. What? Pass? That doesn't make sense. Finally shoot. <laughs> That doesn't make sense earlier. Now we will have three of them. Gonna yeah. Can't do anything about it. Five, eight. Maybe we can try pass. No. Yeah, let's try pass. Dribble two and then uh, pass for the last one. Hope and just hope that the final one trying to guard the ball will won't be successful or won't reach the ball let's pass it to you since he's the nearest one one fumbles pass again just gaining experience points at this point Although that's also good on our side. So I'll need my right defense to do more. This swims a little bit fast. Can't even break Zazi Guado. I mean, maybe he can. Let's try. But it's a tie between their endurance and attack. Okay, good. We can pass it to Letzi again. Definitely can pass it to Waka. It's too far. The ball's gonna fumble again. Hmm. We can break to Nav. Do we attempt Waka again? Or bait this one first? For Tidus. I'll pass it back to Jasu. Then try to bait the one on the left away from the goal hmm there'll still be two guarding we can pass it to Waka wait 8 pass we need to go to Letty first wait I'm gonna bait it a little bit okay Waka is free Oops, that should be enough. No one guarding. I'll go to his Venus shot this time because it might just hit the goalkeeper again. Hmm. You have to be near, I suppose. Almost half time. Both teams are still at zero points. Okay, at least Waka will gain some experience points here. Okay, Jasu and Bada leveled up. That's good. I don't mind Tito's not leveling up since he's already at level 5. But this round, I might have to pass it to Tito's. To ensure that I'll get one point for my team. Okay, we got the ball again. I think there's no problem for Letty. We'll dribble immediately. And we can bait this one. 
Portidus. If the two of them decides to gang up on Tidus, then that's totally fine. We have Jack Shot. Mm. 10, 12. I think we are able to. Hopefully. Hopefully. Okay. Whoops. Two guarding. Okay, fine. We'll use Jack Shot here. Wait, what? Oh, okay. I forgot about that. We'll select afterwards. So instant stun against the two Guados guarding. Hopefully this ensures us a goal. That's a technique now too. the same strategy as me for the most part here keep on dribbling as much as possible but they failed need to pass it need to pass it to Bata. it's not gaining any experience points because he's not interacting with the team Really tightening their goal. Mm. Did a mistake. Gonna get it. At least you wasted time. They're not minding bot at all. Think about it, maybe we could have just left Bora there since they're not after him. Mm. I need to get another score. No one is fed up at the tie, it will extend the match. I will go for that technique next time just to be efficient. On a dream one, huh? Find them. Mm, two of them. We can dribble again. They don't have any text yet. Can't steal it back. Oh, T this. Oh no, two of them. Ten and three. This is bad. If I don't break. Now let's try breaking one. Okay, lucky. That's insanely lucky. Uh, gonna fumble. They still got it anyway. Can we get it? Ball. Yeah, maybe Waka will get it, but I don't think Waka can break through two of them. Let's try. Uh, yeah, they're gonna get it. Oh no, it's gonna tie. No, there's too many of them. Okay, we can break the usual two. And then pass it to... Boom. I'm gonna try Waka again. 
Maybe only one would be able to guard him at this distance. Need to score one more for us, Waka. Oh no, there's another one. Hmm. Maybe you can just dribble. Still able to grab the ball anyway. I should have just stayed on the other side. I think they weren't following Bota anyway while we were leading. We were just focusing on guarding. Oh no. Oh no. No, time's up. It's gonna be another round, I think. Unless it's different than League. We are now on round 8 of the Spirit League and this should be the final round that we need to win. After this, we can forfeit the last 2 sins. After this one, we'll have a total of 7 wins and 1 tie. I doubt that the AIs will still be able to keep up with our number of wins. So let's just get this over with. Oh, and by the way, this is just the first league. We'll have to do another one for the status reels. After this round for the 9th and 10th round, we will just let the enemy score one point and then once the ball is on our side, you, we can press triangle and then select the forfeit option. Wrap against Luka Goers. Mm. Just do the same tactic, try to bait them so that our forwards will have an opening. We can bring it back to Letty. He's our midfielder. Should be able to open up for Waka or Tidus. Okay, Tidus it is. It's easier now since we have two options for Tidus. If the enemy... Well, not the enemy. If... Hmm, never mind. We still managed to get two. Mmm, 12 4. Might as well just use Jack Shot. I think at the moment we can actually now use it twice. Per round. We're not very near to the goal, but it should only degrade by at most 6 maybe. Yeah, for league, you actually only need to win a minimum of seven games. Or if you want to make sure, then make it eight. Then forfeit the last two. Sadly, we got a tie at our very first league match. I have to make sure that. So I have to win mo a little bit more here in the current league. pass it to Waka. Although I think they will still be able to guard him. Yeah, they see him quite fast. I'll need to pass it back to Letty. Mm, they're still chasing Letty. Okay, can't guard. Let's pass it back to Waka. This is the perfect spot for Waka, no one is guarding him, they're really far, even with their speed they won't be able to catch up. You can go very near and just shoot normally without even using a technique. Quite the high endurance, they won't be able to get it. If 
they manage to shoot the we'll try doing the AI exploit where you only be staying on one side until it goes half time okay let's see if we can steal with venom tackle nope, not enough 16 shoot Let's just do a normal. Wait, what? How were you able to grab the ball? Suppose we can bait it again so that Waka will have an opening. Might as well lead. We'll just score again. You have no problem winning against the Luka Goers now. This ball will be 10 times harder if you're playing with Otto. Because <laughs> you can't do the bait technique. AI here is not very smart. Like that one. Let's just do normal again. I find it hilarious that Bota can grab the ball. For endurance for attack. We can definitely pass this one. Waka is the nearest. That's okay. We still reach him. Already half time. Okay, hopefully the ball will be on us. After the half time. Okay, Waka leveled up. Increase in endurance and shoot. The stats that I need. Let's finish this as fast as possible. Need to do one more league for status reels. That's gonna be another seven games minimum. No, the ball's not on us. Maybe because we got the ball when they have time during the halftime. Either shot already. Hmm. Okay, I'll try passing it. Let's pass it to Jasu. Let's see if they will chase him. If they don't, then we'll finish this. We'll do this efficiently. Now they're still chasing. Can do the AI exploit. Uh, pass it to Bata first. Still chasing. We can pass it to Waka. Got an increase in endurance. So maybe you'll have no problem breaking Zora. Unless she uses a technique. Nope. No technique. We're gonna lead with four points. I forgot what's the price for top score. I think only rename card. Not very significant. For the first place prize, I think we will get Teleport Sphere. Could come in handy. I think we only need one Teleport Sphere to customize Evade and Counter with an ability. Or we can use it on the Sphere Grid itself. Okay, let's try it without Venom Tackle. Okay. Finally failed. <laughs> kept on grabbing it earlier, despite what the number shows. They'll score? Yeah. That's totally fine. Okay, we're leading by 4. So Letty is gonna get the ball. For starters, I'll pass it immediately to one of our guards. 
Let's see if they will chase. Let's see if they will chase after them. If we just stay here. No. Yeah. We'll just do this until time runs out. It's gonna be faster this way. I can't remember if I have included this exploit in my Easy Baseball Week tutorials. Whoops, they're starting to move. Once they start moving, you can just keep passing on your two guards. Because every time you pass, the time will keep increasing or keep on moving. There you go, they're starting to move. Let's pass it to Jasu. So once you pass it to Jasu, you just press square again immediately. And then you can pass it back to Bata, although there's someone getting near Bata, so... I'm going to pass it to this for now. Because no one is guarding him. You can just bait them. Bait, bait, bait. Whoops. Let's pass it to Letty. Hmm. Green tackle. No increase in attack. Okay, they just bait them. We have one. No problem for Bixon. Just pass it to Bata again. They're returning. Whoops. Still going at me, huh? Also, by doing this, your guards will be getting lots of experience points because they keep on performing actions. And it's extremely important that you level them up. That way, the enemies will have a hard time breaking through them. Bata. 3 shoot, 9 block. Hmm. Okay, not bad. Okay, let's see the current standings. 7 wins. Only 2 games remaining. So if Guado Glorious manage to win two more games, they'll only be at six wins total. So we'll still be at first place. We can throw the next two games. Make this faster. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Versus Bronze of Hangs. I'll let them win. <laughs> They're one of the easiest teams to win against because their team is quite slow. You can always outrun them. I'll give this one to them. Then we will proceed immediately to the next league. Where status drills will appear as a prize. Our guy runs off. Okay, there will be two guarding him. Pass again. only one guarding you why are you gonna pass I was gonna fumble weird get it 10 pass uh, don't think you can even block it let's pass it to Bata Then I will let the other two runs of guarding get the ball. We're very, very near to the goal now. If you still don't shoot, I don't know anymore. 
pipe shoot. You need to pass that one. You're shooting? Five versus ten? Maybe I should give it to the one with the higher shoot number. Eight, six, okay. We'll just dribble. Gazna. Okay. Fourteen. Shoot. Shoot. Start shooting. I'm letting you shoot. Why are you passing? It's just taking longer. What is this AI? <laughs> You're shooting with just... Why are you the one shooting? Or do you just want to gain some experience points? Okay, three of them guarding me. Break everyone! Let them steal. Don't tell me you're gonna attempt to shoot again. Gazna. Okay. Pass it to the one who has a higher shoot. Nice, finally. Shoot? Okay. We can forfeit. Okay, we can then press triangle, right? And then forfeit. That's okay. Mm, anyone level up? Nothing. Seven, five. God of Glory is one again. Okay, so it turns out that we don't really need or it is not necessary for us to win the final round of the league in Blitzball at the moment because our current standing is we got 7 wins and the other two teams that are behind us got 5 wins. So that means that if we lose, we're still gonna have 7 wins and the other two or one of the other two will have 6 wins. So that means we will still be leading. So what we're gonna do here is that, just like earlier, on the first league, we're gonna let the other team score one point and then forfeit. So that will be very, very quick. We're not gonna try. We're not gonna even try to win this. Good thing we're up against Albert Sykes. This should be quick. I think their AI is one of the best in Blitzball. Okay, that's perfect. We're going after Letty. We're gonna bait them towards the goal. Let them near it. Okay, 15 and 7. Okay, we'll just dribble. Should be able to steal it. Okay, hopefully they proceed to shoot immediately. Hmm. This is the one thing I don't understand why AS do that in baseball. They're already in front, but I mean, they're already in front of the goalie of the opposing team, but they still refuse to shoot. Okay, finally. I'll just do a normal one. Nice, perfect. And the ball's gonna be on us. So we can just press triangle and select the forfeit option. No one's gonna level up because barely anyone moved. And did any action. So there you go. 
our current standing for round 10 ranking. 7 wins, 1 lose, and 2 ties. We're still leading. Second runner up. I mean, second place, Albert Sides. Okay, let's season over and current standing is number one. That means we'll get Waka status reels. Waka's learn overdrive status reels. And Titus is our top scorer for the league. So we get a bonus. Next potion. Okay, let's try if we can make Wait, I'll go back first. Let's try if we can make Aurox Reels of Fear as a tournament prize. Although I'm not sure if I have already met the criteria needed for it to appear. So what we'll do is keep on going back into the Blitz Ball screen until a new tournament appears. Okay. This is how we force a tournament to appear. We'll check what's the first place prize. If it's the Aurox rules, then might as well get it now. Why wait later? We'll only have to do more or less three matches. And if ever we get seeded, then only two matches. Let's see. Hmm, no. Okay. Maybe post airship. That's when it will appear as a prize. 